What is going on guys? We're back to some more Dragon Ball Z Dokken Battle gameplay and we're going to be doing an awakening today. So as you guys saw previously, I pulled Super Saiyan Blue Kaioken times 10 Goku. I pulled this beast of a beast of a motherfucking beast. And we actually got all the medals for him. The event was pretty easy because I have a tech team. I have uh, Super Saiyan 3 Gotenks and I have units like Golden Frieza, uh, Tech Beerus. So I have some pretty good units that I ran to beat the event. So it wasn't really hard at all. So we're going to go ahead and awaken this guy. Now, first of all, before I go ahead with the awakening, let's check out his stats first um, uh, before we awaken him. So first of all, that's him. I prefer this art um, over the awakened version, but that's just me. So we have HP attack and defense up 70% for agility types when he's non doken His super attack, uh, when you do a super attack, you get a 7% a seven percent HP reduction. So he pretty much hurts himself, meaning he hurts you and he hurts your HP. That kind of sucks. And his passive is freaking awesome. So he does uh, 15,000 attack up as well as 7,000 defense up for the first 10 turns. That's freaking awesome. That's freaking uh, fucking amazing. Uh, that's freaking hot, guys. So uh, that's his stats. We're going to go ahead and awaken him. And then we're going to revisit his stats to see what kind of boost he got. So I've been wanting to do this, man. Like, I... Oh, I'm so glad this shit is happening right now. Super Saiyan Blue Kaioken times 10 Goku. My hero team is solid. It is fucking solid. The only thing I'm missing is Super Vegeta. You guys know that. I want him. I can't pull him. You know, it's unfortunate. But uh, here it is, guys. So, Dokkan Awoken, Super Saiyan Blue Kaioken times 10, Goku. Or Geku. <laughs> no, it's not Geku. Uh, so, let's go ahead and check out his new stats. So, here he is. Like I said, I prefer the first art, the non Dokkan uh, version art. But, you know, like I said, that's just me. Uh, still cool with the fist. Looks like a Super Saiyan Blue uh, Kaioken Dragon Fist type of thing. But,. Now his stats go from HP attack and defense 100% for agility type, that's leader ability. So he's not going to give you any key, but he's going to give you a fuck ton of stats in terms of your health, defense, and HP. Um, instead of hurting 7% uh, of your HP, you only get a 5% reduction in HP when you do a super, so that's a bit better. But I think it would have been um, uh, much more tolerable if they did 3% instead of 5%. Because 5% could still be a substantial amount of health if you're in a boss battle and you have like this much health left but uh whatever his passive is clutch so attack goes up 20,000 percent defense goes up 10,000 sorry sorry no no not not percent attack goes up 20,000 at, at additional to what he already has uh and defense goes up 10,000 not percent just 10,000 additional to what he has and that's for the first 10 turns so that's freaking awesome that's freaking sick that it's freaking hot guys so i like that links are freaking solid as hell uh let me just check out the links actually let me see what's going on here so uh this looks like super saiyan uh huh, huh, huh. all right links are pretty solid so there we go so we have a pretty good team going on uh actually having stones so why not do a summons why not just you know just do one uh five stone summon i mean I don't expect to get anything freaking amazing, but you never know. I mean, magic can happen, right? Magic has happened before in the channel. So we might be able to pull off some magic right here on camera. So let's see if we can get some good shit. Uh, of course, you know, we want Super Vegito, but I mean, you know, we, we're doing one summon. So, you know, we don't even know what's going to happen here. Uh, we got nothing, no Hercule, no Saiyan Pods. Rainbow, Rainbow Super Saiyan. I, I, I was feeling low key that he was not going to go Super Saiyan, but whatever. Uh, still a chance, Super Saiyan 1, Super Saiyan 2, no Super Saiyan 3. What's it going to be, guys? I'll take that. I'll take that. That's not bad. I need, I think, one more of him to max him out to SA10, and then I can do kind of weaken him. So that was actually a decent pull. I'm not mad about that at all. So... I'm going to take it, guys, but there he goes. So, Super Saiyan Blue, Kyle Ken is now awakened. If you want to see the uh, video gameplay to beat his event to get the medals, click the annotation above in the little corner right here next to my head. Click it, check it out, check out the boss fight. It's a pretty easy boss fight, especially if you have a tech team. I personally use a, um, a tech team to beat the event. Uh, of course, having Super Saiyan 3 Gotenks as a lead, but I might do other, um, you know, um, you know, other teams such as, you know, uh, Buhan team, I have Buhan. Um, what else, who else do I have? 
Uh, I don't have anyone else besides um, Super Saiyan 3, Gotenks, and Buhan. Wow. Uh, oh, well, whatever. So, anyways, guys, thank you for watching the video, guys. Please like the video, share the video, comment down below, guys. We'll be seeing you in the next video. Bye-bye.